Hey, I'm Shenanigans. You can call me Shan. This is what's coming up this episode. I've been loyal to you so far. Rex. You did more for me than my family ever did. But if I'm going to keep following you, I need to know we're doing it for the right. <gasps> Rex! Our influence will stop staring. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. I do too. That was a really good speech. Um, But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? Oh, no, no, no! Screw that! We can handle ourselves. Go back and get Elenko. Am I choosing between them? Okay. Are we ready to go to Vermeer? 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 Okay. Oh man. Um, I'm actually really nervous. I don't know what is in store for there. Like, I don't know what's in store for us there. And I'm scared it's going to be really tough. Uh, we're gonna do it. Okay. Um. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Shepard, this is Admiral Kahoku. I found out who set that trap for my men. The ones killed by the Thresher War. Oh. Damn, I hope you get this message. It was a group called Serpers. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, highest level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments, trying to create some kind of super soldier. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Okay. Now it's up to you. This is... This is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. I need to disappear before they find me. So we've heard of that Cer Cerberus group before, I feel like, right? They were the ones, there was a mission, and it was the Acid Maw mission, I think, where they were putting it in the veins of people to see what it would do, I think. So they're obviously a, a horrible organization. Um, okay, so then maybe what we'll do is we'll do Vermeer. Also, that looks really pretty. Vermeer is a lush frontier world, ideal for colonization by carbon-based species. Its vast seas and orbital position on the inner life zone have created a wide equatorial band of humid and tropical terrain. So it's an island. Ah, uh, that'll be like the first I island? thing we've been to. I mean, I can't remember going to anything else. We've been to a lot of cold places, I feel like. A lot of places that are super red. Uh, but nothing, I think, that looks like this, really. Um, okay. But maybe we'll do this, and then we'll go do the Cerberus, I guess. Mission? Okay. Um, I'm gonna take with me. I'm gonna take, I think I'll take Rex, and I'll take Elinko. Oh, Kaden. All right, uh, that's good to me. I think, yeah, that'll be good. Commander, I'm reading a signal. Must be our Solarian infiltration team. Check out those defense towers. Drop the Mako. We'll go in hot and take them out. I'll get you in underneath their radar, Commander. <laughs> that looks so cool. 
I love it. All right. You've got a clean drop, Commander. All right. Good job, Joker. Stay out of range and continue evasive maneuvers until I bring those AA towers down. I know the drill. <laughs> Bitch at the camp once those towers are offline. Joker, Joker out. out. I know the drill. He's like, lady, don't tell me how to do my job. Okay. Uh, let's get in the Mako. All right. We ready? Oh, I... Mm, what a way to start off. Just randomly shooting, right? What's that? Are those the defense towers they were talking about? Or are those, like, satellites? What are these? They look like little crustaceans, kind of? Like, little crabby guys? Why is my mako like this? Oh, no, no, no! Oh, oh, I don't want to hit it. Oh, that... Okay, um... Okay, let's scare the crap out of me. All right, we have a lot. It looks like we have a lot up here. Are they all... Oh, that's a crab guy? I don't know what that is. It looks like... No! Sorry, crab guy. Oh, gosh. Oh, crab guy. I didn't mean to hit you. Very smart. Oh, I really need to stop doing that. Almost taken. Please move! I'm like, I feel like they're like the, the gas bags, right? Oh, oh, ooh. The things on Eden Prime where they were harmless, but they just look nasty. Well, okay. Hello. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's something. Why am I driving like a maniac today? I mean, I guess it's not that different from how I normally drive. It just feels different here. Maybe it's the water that makes it feel that way. I don't know. Oh, there are so many enemies. I got enemies. Got a lot of enemies. Woo! I'm just, what, ha what happens if I drive off that? I probably die, don't I? Champ is just my favorite thing. Oh crap, I have to remember there's some somebody in the comments that I can equip stuff and it won't I can like maybe get around being champ. Oh my goodness, I got this, I got this. Oh my god, why are there so many? Go oh, oh there's still one guy over here. Man, is there another guy here? Yeah, there is. Where is it? Oh okay. This was a, an interesting way to start this, wasn't it? Oh my. Oh my gosh, it's a drone. That hit both of them? How? That's so weird. How would that hit both of them? I don't know, that seems like the game giving me a free beam. Well. Nice. Okay. Oh shoot, where? Where's this? Oh, it's behind here. Oh. My. Hold on, you. My little spidey senses. On you. What else? Ooh, a jammer! Ew, they look like little. Oh gosh, what is it? It's like it's like a cross between like frog and I don't even. Oh oh oh! Hi. Oh my god. Let's scare the crap. Man, oh man, oh man. Is 
there anything else here? That sound of rain and thunder in the background, it's, it's a little off-putting. It makes me feel a little uneasy. I don't love it. Do not recommend zero out of 10. All right. Looks like there's a turret up ahead. Oh, that is not a turret. That is a big guy. That's a big old guy. Hi. Uh. Oh my gosh, you have so much health. Why do you have so much health? Uh, friend, I just need you to die. Can you die? Can you die? Can you die? Ooh, level up. Level up. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, ooh. Oh, my. There's two of them there? That's fun. And then there's something up here, too. that one big. I feel like, oh, he's a colossus. That's why he's real big. Why could, oh, I'm overheated. Why could the Thresher Mall have been like this though? Just doesn't follow you. Just has weird, strange pathing. I think that, I think that got stuck. I think it's why it's like that. Oh, dang it. These things are everywhere. Oh my goodness. What is going on on Vermeer, Vermeer, whatever, however you say it. It is so creepy looking though. That thing is so creepy. Oh, look at it just stare at me as I say how creepy it is. Okay. Artillery, what are we looking at? What are we looking for? shadow oh my gosh you guys i was scared by a shadow whoa my lord oh my lord okay okay you go why Oh, 
Stand up, girl. I've really, I think I need a new control. Oh, disable the gun power. But where's the gun? What is it talking about? This is the power. Is that it up there? I can't even. Generator still active. I'm reading that the grid is down, Commander. Okay. On approach to the Solarian base now. Out. Ready to move out, Commander. There's still. I see a, a an exclamation mark. Oh. Oh, that was it. Okay. Oh, good. I, I thought I saw another exclamation mark. I was like, what am I missing? But I'm not missing anything. I don't think. Maybe I am. I don't know. I seem to miss a lot of things. Um, I totally missed the grenade box <laughs> on Barrows and killed half the colonists. So that was, that was super fun. I really loved that for me. Situational awareness. Uh, ten oh, what is that? Oh, oh, it's me. It's me. That's a me. That's me, right? That's us. That's us. Don't drive off the edge. Don't drive off the edge. Oh, one right next to each other? That's weird. They have them like back to back. Little gate. Now, did they put these here? Did the get build this? Oh, shoot, shoot. They said there was a Solarian infiltration team. Was the Solarian here at one point? to me and I don't know why. I guess I've never noticed them until today. I need to send Rex up ahead, I think. Weapon locker. That's the, That's last, the last one. one. We should be able to reach the Solarian camp. All right, all right. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome, awesome, awesome. High fives all around. High fives all around. You guys are the best. Love you guys. Love you. Mean it. Say it back. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, I almost missed stuff. It really is pretty, but I just hate those storm noises. It's very ominous. It's very scary. It makes me feel like bad things are gonna happen. This way, right? I'm not going backwards, am I? Down at the base, but it looks like we're, we're grounded. grounded. What a the Solarian captain can explain. Oh, here. okay. Well, why are we grounded? What happened? 
be in trouble. Is this like, what happened? What's going on? So what are we oh, supposed hi, to do Ashley. now? Stay put until we can come up with a plan. Uh, I was like looking around everywhere. Status, I guess. Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. Are you kidding? Oh, that's just <laughs> great. What now? <laughs> We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. Oh. What? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. Oh. Sorry, they're not coming. But you have us. I mean, we're here. Is... He's probably not super excited about that. <laughs> Sorry. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here. It's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. Saren? Is he here? Have you seen him? No, but his Geth are everywhere and we've intercepted some comms referring to Saren. Okay. This is his facility. There's no doubt about that. Okay. Um... Well, if this is his facility... We read... It was great for colonization. What else? Did it say anything else that it might be good for that would have maybe given us clues as to what he might be doing here? The little, like, blurb about the, the system, the island, whatever it is before we landed here. This is his facility. What is he, what's he doing? What's Saren yeah. researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? What? Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the genophage. He's discovered a cure for the genophage. Genophage, okay. What's so important about curing this genophage? Oh my genophage? god, you're an idiot! It was the solution Why to the Krogan problem. Why did I say that? You're problem. a fucking idiot, We chef. introduced the genophage to the Krogan population after the uprising, to quell their numbers. Without it, the Krogan will quickly overrun the galaxy. And these Krogan follow Saren. I, I don't know what to say to this. What is... We have to stop this? What are we stopping? The cure for the genophage? Is that what... I want to say things just get worse because literally things just get worse. I'm surprised that I'm not able to say it's not that simple. <laughs> I want to be able to say things just get worse, but I know that that is not... We have to stop this. We have to stop what? The cure? Saren? We certainly have to stop Saren. The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army. He'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. <laughs> Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. That is my friend, sir. Shut the fuck up. That is so sad. You're not a mistake, Rex. You're not a mistake. That's really sad. We already have enough. I know. Uh, I know. He's not going to be a problem. He'll listen. Yeah, he'll, he'll listen. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? I understand. Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. 
We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. Ooh. He's in one of the Ooh. tents nearby. Okay, I need to... I need to sound myself. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. Looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. Ashley? He deserves to blow a gasket in this moment. He was just told that there's a cure for genophage, but now we're gonna have to... I mean... Karahi... Kirahi? Karahi? Kirahi? The Salarian captain just said we have to blow up all these secrets, and I'm guessing by secrets he means this cure as well. So yeah, he has a right to blow a gasket. Any... Ashley, I just need you to shut the fuck up. Just drop it. He'll be fine. If you say so. But I'm gonna keep my eye on him, if it's all the same to you. I... Ashley, I just need you to immediately stop talking. <laughs> I need you to... What is that? Who's shooting? Rex. Oh, buddy. What are you doing? Sweetheart, what's going on? Oh. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the genophage, we can't destroy it. Easy, Rex. I understand you're upset, but we both know Saren's the enemy here. He's the one you should be angry with. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. Oh, Rex. Then there's the line. There's the line that I see. <laughs> said it in... I feel like I've said it several times. Not that simple. This isn't a cure, it's a weapon, and if Saren is allowed to use it, you won't be around to reap the benefits. None of us will. That's a chance we should be willing to take. This is the fate of my entire people we're talking about. I've been loyal Aww, to you so far. Rex. Now, you did more for me than my family ever did. But if I'm going to keep following you, I need to know we're doing it for the right <gasps> Krogan are not your people. They're slaves of Saren, tools. Is that what you want for them? No, we were tools for the Council once. To thank us for wiping out the Rachni, they neutered us all. I doubt Saren will be as generous. All right, Shepard, you've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. Oh, I feel... Ooh, plus 28 Paragon. Um, that's really nice. Liar, what are you doing here? <laughs> Is everybody... Is everybody here? Um, God, I feel so bad. He has this cure, and he's being told he can't... He has to destroy it? Oh, that's awful. So awful. Okay. Oh, buddy, I'm so sorry. I'm surprised that Krogan yielded to your argument. 
Why? He's not a Why? He's a good person. Why would you say that? You're an asshole. Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anything would calm him down. You didn't? Well, I did because I have faith in my buddy. Oh my god, what is she going to say? It won't be oh, an easy fight, Lord. but we're ready when you thank are. Thank the Lord. <laughs> Normally I wouldn't think much of Solarians in a final fight, <laughs> but these soldiers seem well trained. I such a devil. What a turd thing to say. Oh my goodness. Hi, Tali's here too. Hi, friend. The upcoming battle frightens me, but I know Saren must be stopped. Oh. We got this. It's fine. Um, okay. I feel so bad for Red. All right, I think I need to. It was saying that I was coming close. I think I need. Greetings, human. I am Commander Rentola. I can provide you with supplies for the upcoming mission. For anything else, I suggest you speak with Captain Kirahi. Crap, Kirahi. Okay, show me your spot. Let me see what you have. What little there is. Can I? I can sell stuff though, can I? Surely. Ooh, more licenses. Okay. All junk. Yes. I cannot believe that we have to tell Rex. There has to be there has to be a way to help him down the line, right? Like if I tell him that now, can I I just feel so bad. I just feel so bad. Shepard just had to tell someone that she cares for and respects very much that the cure to his entire race's problem has to be destroyed. I mean, it's a wonder he didn't leave. Oh, it makes me so sad. That makes me so sad. Solarians seem pretty tough. I just hope they hold up under pressure. <laughs> Does Rex have anything else? If we're doing this, then let's go. What about Liara? Your ability to calm the Krogan is impressive. I didn't calm him. He's my friend. I don't like the way they're talking about Rex. They're acting like he's just some... I don't like it. I don't like it. It's making me mad at everybody. I'm surprised you were able to reason with a Krogan. I want to... Stop talking about him like that. <laughs> it's not okay. Everyone needs to stop. He's a person. He's a good person. Stop it. Right. I think I've done everything that I can here. I've sold off some stuff. I've talked to Rex. I've talked to all the team. All right. Let's go back. Kirahi. Oh, wait. Did I talk to these guys? It's rare to see a Krogan accept reason. You command exceptional loyalty. I don't command anything. We're friends. <laughs> Stop it. A Krogan that responds to reason. Okay, I hate it here. I like we gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Shep's not gonna listen to this stuff. All right. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. So? I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a twenty kiloton ordnance. Crude but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Okay, but where? Where do we take the nuke, and how do we get there? 
The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. He's... I... He's right? Right? He's right? Caden would know. Yeah. It does sound a bit risky. Is there no other way? No, but I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. You'll all be killed? Oh my god, why is that an option? You'll... Good idea, but your people are gonna get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. Wait, you'll all be killed and die. You want one of my men. I need one of your men to accompany me to help coordinate with the teams. That's a bold request. I don't want to say either of these. I, I, oh. That's a bold request. You expect me to commit one of my people to your command? We are all soldiers by trade. If your people are not prepared to face such a risk, would you really want them by your side? He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. Excuse me? Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Solarians. Uh. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, <laughs> with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? Um, okay, uh... Okay, so I would, they said, I, Ashley said I would need Caden to do the bomb. The bomb's gonna be set up on the... They're sneaking in the front, but the bomb is going to be set up on the far side of the facility. So why? That doesn't make sense for Caden to go with them, right? If he's... But besides, like, Caden... Caden stays with me. That's just how it's been. And I think it does make more sense. I mean, what Ashley said was right. He does... It, that just makes more sense. Yeah. Now I'm like second guessing it. I was literally like a button push away. And now I'm second guessing it. But if I say, do I have to have, do I have to have her in my party though? If I, I don't want two soldiers. Like it's better for me to have. Say take Ash. Williams, you'll accompany the captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation okay. sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, SDK. Commander? Uh, Solarian exoplanet. There we go. The Normandy's picking me up. How will your teams escape the blast? We will engage the Geth as long as possible. Once the bomb is in place, we will fall back to try and escape the blast radius. If we move quickly, we should be able to escape with acceptable casualties. If not, then our memories will live on as martyrs to a oh, greater cause. Oh no, this sounds horrible. Sounds dangerous. You talk like this is a suicide mission. Sounds like it. I won't lie to you, Commander. There is a chance none of us will survive this assault, even your team. But we do what is necessary. Okay, well... I thought Vermeer was going to be hard in a different way. Not because of stuff like this. I had to tell Rex no over the genophage. No, I'm on a suicide mission. Great. Love this. <laughs> okay, uh, investigate. Other teams. Shadow seems clear enough. What would the other teams be called? Eigor, Manovai, and Jeto. They were the initial settlements on our first three colony worlds. They are at the heart of Solarian territory to this day. These names will remind my men what they are fighting for. They must have a personal stake in the fight if we are to have any chance of success. All right, investigate one more time. Oh, no. I don't want to... Oh, the nuke. I want to know more about the bomb. 
How reliable is it going to be? Its reliability depends on the person arming it, but it will do the job. The drive system is highly impervious to damage from external sources. Once it has been armed, very little can stop it. The key is getting it into place and armed before the Geth can stop us. All right. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone, Auntie. <laughs> you too, Commander. We'll be fine. You'll see. Yeah, I just... Good luck. What is it? Is there something you want to say, Chief? I don't know. It's just weird. Going under someone else's command. I've got used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry. We'll see you on the other side. I know. No! I... It's been an honor serving with you, Commander. Not the end game speeches! No! Okay. Also... She made a point to say all of you. And I think... Um, I think she was meaning the alien as well. We're a team. It doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We are still a team. Watch each other's backs. Keep your eyes open and fight like I know you can. Yeah. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. We got this. It's fine. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends. But the records are sealed. Glory in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. A silent step who defeated a nation with a single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden facts. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. Our influence will stop Saren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. I do too. That was a really good speech. Um, it was a good speech. We will hold the line. Okay. Oh no, Ashley's not with us. That's really sad. Take Rex. I'm gonna take Rex. And I'm gonna take Caden. Whatever happens here, Rex deserves to be a part of it, and Caden has to do the bob, so. Oh man. We will hold the line. Good. <laughs> Com check. Do you read me, Commander? Permanent, I read you. Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish okay. the job. And Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the All help. Right. Let's go. Ooh, what was that noise? Okay. Yep, yep, shadow yep, Shadow is on yep. the ground. Repeat, shadow see, is on I the see, ground. I see, I see. Brilliant. E-14. Time to get some attention. Model Vice has a coordinated crossfire. Check for long range turrets helping the Geth target. Right. Where. Where is that coming from? Can I take these out from here? A little bit? There has to be. Is there something up there? Jammed. Alright. Oh, my. All right. 
alright, alright, alright. <laughs> Where did he go? Oh, he's over there. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, I'm getting, I'm getting shot. I need to pay attention, but that was really funny. Power disrupt. Okay. Okay. Uh, 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 anything else here? Does it look like it? Do we keep going this way? Ooh. I don't like that music change, nor do I like all these bugs. Disgusting. Something scrambled. They're targeting. We got a shot. Okay. Chief Williams. Take okay. Shot. So I'm helping. Like maybe I'm helping. Okay. Okay. Whatever I'm doing. Oh, yikes. All right. Take cover. Just that. I see. That it was only that one on my map. That's so weird. He was just out here by himself. Oh, okay. Now I see more. There's one here. Oh, it's a drone. They're calling sat strikes. Jayetto, watch for comm stations. William, can you see anything? many bugs but I mean I lived on an island for quite a while so that's pretty accurate go out for a run and you just eat like a thousand little things as you run the aircraft heading to perimeter stations to recharge bunker up before they come back this way? I see things on my map this seems to have 
more enemies. Hello. Oh, um, hang on. I learned this in bro. I feel like this gun is probably better for the Krogan because they regenerate so quickly. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, gosh. Wait, it's going to get up again. Yes. Oh, no. Okay. Maybe this? I'm gonna have to, how, what's, what, what, why is he just standing there? Where am I? Is it dead? Where? Okay, I was gonna say, where is everybody? What is it? Oh my gosh. Is it bug? Why are they reacting this way? I feel like they're bugged. It was just standing there. That is really unfortunate. <laughs> not for me though. For them, not for me. Okay, that's down. It's a Krogan. <gasps> I should maybe shoot, 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 shoot. Is something behind me? Is something behind me? <gasps> wait, 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 wait. What does that mean? What does that mean? Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Is he dead? Is he dead? Oh no. Tell me he's not dead. Maybe it's just hurt. Maybe he's just hurt. Um What does that mean? Okay. I'm hoping he's just hurt. <laughs> oh my, oh my, I didn't even know that guy was there. Got access to base security. Should be able to cut the alarms from here. Might even be able to trigger alarms on the far side of the hey. base. It'll clear the guards out for us, but they might be too much for Williams and the Solarians to handle. They have they have enough trouble. Yeah, they've got enough trouble. We're not doing that. Just disable the alarms. We can handle any yeah, guards inside. Yeah, we can do this. We can do. Let's see. We. Oh my goodness. That's a lot. Okay. It's all right, we've got it. We're, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Ugh. Oh my goodness, there's way more. Of course they're looking the wrong way. Oh, why the, a Solarian? What are you doing? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh 
Oh my goodness. Why are you doing this? Doctor needed. What in the world? Someone out there? Oh. oh no. Okay, okay. Is there, is there a way to get down there? Ooh, oh my. So that just immediately uh oh uh, it's hold on you. <laughs> oh, there's another one? Why are what happened here? Okay, can we hold him here? Sorry, oh, Ashley, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm Come coming. On, Separate How do I... Where does this go? It's up here. Is this that... Are these the things? Doctor needed. <laughs> what do you want? I told you everything. I... Who are you? Alliance, right? I knew someone would come. It tried to break me, but it couldn't. I shut it out. Are you okay? Slow down. I need to know where you came from. Private Maino Savat of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG, man. Captured while on reconnaissance six days ago. Glad to answer, man. Never any questions from these bastards. Just whispers and poking and cutting. I said anything to get out and get some payback. That's not too much to ask, is it? A little payback? Are you... Are you... But I don't want to say that. What happened to you? What did they do to you, soldier? Experiments, but I don't know what for. The effect of incessant whispering on my shortening temper. Who knows? I just need out. Something's not right here, Commander. Okay, well... <laughs> I can't just leave him. If we don't let him out, he's as good as dead. We have to do something. Yes, leaving me here would be bad. Very bad. It's too small and the noise just won't go away. Whispering is loud, you know? I need to get out. Okay. Let okay. me out. Alright, let him out. Oh, look at that. Look at the glass. Uh, Alright, let him out. Set him free. Yeah. It could help us. Yes, sir. You'll find I am very good at following orders. I should be. Sir. I hear them over and over. Why are they repeated when they are so you simple? Call me sir. <laughs> simple! Okay. Wait, what? No! Oh my gosh, why? <gasps> what is going on? Wait, 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 wait! What? What? Not now, Commander. I'm a little busy here. Wait. Oh gosh, there's two more. Where? Oh, downstairs. He 
called me sir. What is going on? Oh, there's a lot of people down here. Okay. Indoctrinated. I love that it tells on them right through the door. <laughs> is that a bug or is it a feature? <laughs> uh, let's open the door. Oh, and Caden's already shooting through it. And there's nothing there. I think it's behind that wall back there that I can't get through or something. All right, let's see. Not a gaff, and you're not wearing a lab coat. I guess I'm glad to see you. Lieutenant Gonto Imnes of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, captured during recon. I assume the fleet was called in to destroy the base? Sorry, I'm all you get. The transmission wasn't clear. The fleet's not coming. I see. Then you must be the infiltration team. I know the captain. He will want this facility destroyed. My team was okay. altered, indoctrinated. He knew about the breeding Wait, what? Grounds. But the indoctrination is a greater okay. threat, and far more horrifying. I watched good people reduced to mindless husks. There wasn't anything left. Others died during the experiments. I envy them. Tell me about the research. Do you know anything about the experiments they were conducting? They were studying indoctrination. Symptoms. Progress. Saren uses it to control his people, but I don't think he fully understands it. I don't know much else. I, I just saw what it did to the others. Turn them into empty husks. I can't end up like that. Please, let me out. I mean, you guys, all I can do is just like keep doing the right thing, right? I just, I just have to keep doing the right thing, right? Like I think I can trust you. And I guess if I can't, I'll just take care of it. I'm opening your cell, but then you're on your own. Don't look back and hope to outrun the blast, hmm? A better chance than I had before you showed up. Thank you, human. And good luck. <laughs> Thank you, You'll human. Need it. Good luck to you. Can I do... Can I do this for them? Like, can I open that... No threat here, Commander. Are they even aware of us? No, oh, this is no way to treat a prisoner. Kill them, sure, but leave them like this. Let them out. Open the doors. Give them yeah. a chance to outrun yeah. the blast. Are you sure? We should at least no. stay there. No, they're no threat. They're no threat. We're not gonna we're not gonna do that. Let them out. Yeah. They won't hurt us. Alright, Commander, but I don't It's like okay. It. You don't have to. You don't have to like it. It's okay. It calls, and I must follow. I am only what it wants me to be. It is emptiness. There will be nothing but the voice. Did... Is this like the Thorian? But I don't remember the colonists talking like this when... Did they talk like this when they were turned? I can't remember. Um, but is that the technology he's using? Like whatever he gathered from the Thorian? 
don't think we've gone through this one yet. Hey, Rex. Thanks <laughs> for not shooting me, buddy. <laughs> Love you. Uh, but it's like, what? What is this? What is this? What? Is, what is that? What is that? Investigate. I can investigate it. I can. I can talk to them. <gasps> Oh, no, 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 wait, where's the scientist? Oh, a sorry, doctor, what did that say? Did they say doctor? Oh, it's a Krogan, a Krogan doctor. What is going on? Where are they going? Where is this? Is Saren here? Wait, is Saren here? Oh, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Do I use adrenaline burst? Oh no. Oh no. I don't I don't want to use any of these yet because what if this gets worse? Okay. Uh crap, 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 crap. Why am I I don't Where's the other two? Send me back here. Alright. Yikes, wait, can I go and look at those things again? Can I investigate? I there was an option. Ooh, upgrade. Okay, where's that? There was an option to talk to that husk. It's unfortunate that I didn't get to. Can I investigate this? No. I guess it's done now. Can I go through here? Oh, I can. It's through here. Nothing? This way, maybe? Ah! Oh, my! Here before it's too late. Uh, calm down. I'm not gonna hurt you. Who are you? Ranathanoptis, neurospecialist. But this job isn't worth dying over, or worse. You think the indoctrination only affects prisoners? Sooner or later, Saren will want to dissect my brain Wait, too. Wait, what are you talking about? I thought this was a breeding yeah. facility. Not this level. We're studying Sovereign's effect on organic minds. At least that's what I assumed. Saren kept us in the dark as much as possible. You helped him and you don't even know why? I didn't have the option of negotiating. This position is a little more permanent than I had expected. But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? Okay. I am so... Tell me about your research. What were you studying here? It's that ship, Sovereign. It emits some kind of signal. Undetectable, okay. but it's there. I've seen the effects. Saren uses it to influence his followers. To control them. It's called indoctrination. Direct exposure to the signal turns you into a mindless slave, like the Solarian test subjects. But there's collateral damage. Investigate. Collateral damage. Saren's interest, sovereign signal. Collateral damage. What do you mean by collateral damage? Sovereign signal is too strong. Spend too much time near the ship and you feel it, like a tingle at the back of the skull. It's like a whisper you can't quite hear. You're compelled to do things, but you don't know why. You just obey. Eventually, you just stop thinking for yourself. It happens to everyone at the facility. My first test subject was the man I replaced. Now I just want to get out of here before it happens My to me. My first test subject was the man I replaced. So she has also been... 
I mean, I just want to get out of here before it happens to me. Oh, so you weren't concerned about doing your task until it came for you. Hmm, girl, I don't know if you're getting out of here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you're getting out of here. Saren's interests. Why is Saren researching this? Isn't he the one controlling it? The signal comes from the ship. It makes us obey Saren, but I don't think he controls it. Not exactly. I think he's scared it might be affecting him. Indoctrination is subtle. By the time the effects become noticeable, it's usually too late. All right, I got one more investigate, I think. Sovereign signal. Tell me more about this signal. Signal's not exactly the right word. There's some kind of energy field emanating from the ship. It changes thought patterns. Over time, days, maybe a week, it weakens your will. You become easier to manipulate and control, but it's a degenerative condition. There's a balance between control and usefulness. The less freedom a subject maintains, the less capable it becomes. Okay. I, I think Shep is so tired of this. Uh, every, oh, okay, you deserve to die. <laughs> you conducted brutal experiments on helpless mm -hmm. test subjects. You yep. helped Saren. You don't get to live. I just did I don't what care. I was told. I didn't have a choice. I'm oh, sorry. Oh, you had a choice. Too late. Sorry doesn't help your victims. No. No! I don't feel bad. I don't feel bad. Shep has had to look at her best buddy, this man that she cares for and respects and be like, I'm sorry, you can't have the cure to the genophage. Then she had to go and look at all those slaves downstairs and then this lady helped put them there and she thinks she gets to walk away from that. Nah. Shep has reached her fuck around and find out phase. I think she has she's reached the end of her rope with all of this. This is too much. This is too much. How do you do all this and then you beg for mercy later? No. No quarter, no mercy. Sorry. Not today. Ooh, exclamation point. So through here. Wait. Maybe I should save. Oh, I can't save. Okay. Is it is this right though? I'm so sorry, Rex, but you know what? We're gonna fix this. We're gonna fix this. There has to be a way to fix this. Is there, maybe there's like journals or something I can find. Oh, I should have searched that lab. Should I have sure? Mm. But I looked around and I didn't see anything. What is this? Commander, look over here. It's another beacon. Like the one on Eden Prime. Down. See, and that's why. That's why. There is no coming back. We need to wipe yes, this whole base do. out. Okay. Oh shit! What's this? I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. <laughs> Same. You are not Saren. What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. 
understanding. I don't think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am sovereign. The ship? What? Wait, what? <laughs> the ship? Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. Reaper? A label created by the Protheans to give voice to their Wait, destruction. What? In the end, what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You couldn't have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither and die. We are eternal, the pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. We are the end of everything. Oh my goodness. We are eternal. I don't stand alone, yeah. There is an entire galaxy of races united and ready to face you. Confidence born of ignorance. The cycle cannot be broken. Cycle? What cycle? The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance, and at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found oh them. Gosh. The legacy of my kind. You merely found them. I have goosebumps. Holy shit. What the fuck? Uh, I don't understand. I yeah, don't know. Uh. Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it, and you will end. Because we demand it. They're harvesting <gasps> us. Letting us advance to the level they need. Then wiping what? us out. Why are you doing this? What do you want from us? Slaves? Uh. Resources? My kind transcends your very understanding. We are each a nation. Independent. Free of all weakness. You cannot even grasp the nature of our existence. Hey, uh, who created you? Where did you come from? Who built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, we will endure. Are there more of you? Where are the rest of the Reapers? Are you I the hope last so. of your kind? <laughs> We are legion. What is that? The we time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. Numbers will darken the sky of every world. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'll stop you. You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine, and machines can be broken. I love her call. Are as empty as your future. I am the vanguard of your destruction. This exchange is over. Oh, oh, what? What is that? What just happened? Commander, we got trouble. What's wrong? Hit me, Joker. That ship Sovereign, it's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but Wait. that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our okay. ships in half. Okay. It's coming your way and it's coming um, hard. You need to wrap things up and okay, fast. Okay. This console is shot. 
Orders, Commander. Uh, we're done here. Let's head to the breeding facility. Joker can pick us up after we set the nuke. Okay. Where is the... Oh, gosh. <laughs> Where's the breeding facility? Where do I go? Oh, no. Sovereign is a reaper. It's not just a ship. Holy shit. Uh. Oh, yikes, 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 yikes. All right, let's see if I can see. Cell block, genophage lab. What is this? Breeding facility entrance, okay. I don't even know what to think. What does that mean? The geth are turning. Shepard, okay, we're okay, 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 Jantum, okay. Around. Keep them here. What is that? Oh, Ashley, 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 I'm coming. I'm so overwhelmed in this mode. Oh, great. Hi, Krogan. Oh my God, it just had to be Krogan. You know, part of me, like, oh man, really? I was like, why do the Krogan want to fight? Why do they want to stand with Saren? I mean, we know now, and I kind of don't blame them because I, he was probably like, I have a cure for you. Many jump deploy. of all these people being like, I didn't know. I didn't know aligning with these really bad people was gonna have a really, oh, look at that gun. That's it. Oh, I'm jammed too, fun, fun. Oh, that's so funny, I was just talking about that. I guess we have to go do something about it, don't we? That's why, I, oh, 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 fuck you. Oh, that little jammer. They should slow down. Oh, it's there. Wait. <gasps> you little. Guess ghost. Who <laughs> I hate. Wait, where is it coming from? Oh my gosh. There's so. Ooh, a drone. Oh, there's another one. <gasps> oh, there's so many. There's so many. Are these all thrones? There's so many. All right. I see the X. I'm guessing this turns off that gun. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Yep. Wait, 
there's one more. Oh my god, it's literally oh, there's so many. Nice work on that gun, Commander. We've got the other one in our okay. sights. All right. I'm less panicked now, Ashley. Seems like she's okay. Okay. My guys. I like that I'm staring at them as we're in the elevator. It's so awkward. I'm sure they're like, Shep, can you please like turn the fuck around? <laughs> All right. There's the gun. Clear those gaps and get the charges set. No. Oh, 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 oh. Uh-huh. Let's see. <gasps> oh, there it is. That's good. That's good. Where? I hear him. Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay. We got this. Yeah! Nice job, guys. All right. Uh, now we just have to set off the bomb. Hey, right, Kaden with me. in position. We're all set here. Commander, can you read me? I read you. The nuke is almost ready. Get to the rendezvous point, Williams. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We're taking <gasps> no. heavy casualties. Captain Kirahi is dead. We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Oh no, he's dead? Joker, now! Negative! It's too hot! What Can't do you mean? It. We'll hold them off as long as we can. It's okay, Commander. I need a okay. couple of minutes to finish arming okay. the bomb. Go get them and meet me back okay. here. I can't believe the cat is dead. This sucks. Okay. Good idea. Alright, you finish and finish and I go get Ashley. Up to the AA tower. Move. Oh my god, Caden can't be with me. Oh, I hate this so much. I don't have okay. This is fine. It's fine. Rex and Garris. Of course he can't be with me. He's bombing or he's setting up a bomb. Where do I need to go? Could I have saved him? What did I do? I literally... Oh. I hate that. We will pull the luck. Oh, he's dead! I really liked him. 
for him to have not been on the screen very long for me. He was very well written because I really, I really like that little NPC. Oh shit. Oh my god, what are you doing? What, what is going on? I'm like stuck. Wait, what is, she's, you guys, she's stuck. Oh my god, what is happening? Ah, oh no, what is happening? I'm so, okay. <laughs> Oh, you don't want to cry anymore? Just have it have a glitch in your game. It's fine. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I was stuck. Oh, oh, oh. He's stuck too. Alright. You guys, there was a pro oh, yeah, ghost. Where are they? Oh, poor lord. Oh my god, there's so many. Well, that was something. <laughs> Can you hold them off? There's too many. I don't think we can survive until you get here. I'm activating no, 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 the bomb. No, no, just hold on, just hold on. Alenka, what are you doing? I'm just making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Screw that. We can handle ourselves. Go back and get Alenko. choosing between them Is that what I'm doing? Alenko, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, commander. I, I... You know it's the right choice, LT. I'm sorry, Ash. I had to make a choice. I understand, Commander. I don't regret a thing. I don't regret a thing. Okay, what do I do now? way different. I, I knew it was going to be hard. I just, I didn't know it was going to be hard like this. I thought it was going to be like, like a dungeon crawl hard, <laughs> not Game of Thrones hard where you lose people that, wait, what is that? 
Oh, they're on my side. Okay. Uh... Okay. Oh, shit. Fuck off. I hate everybody and everything. is just a puppet she's kind of like the dancing monkey for everybody you know like she's the just the go-to errand runner and look he's just a puppet just a puppet you're like every other poor bastard in this place a tool sovereign can use then cast aside I've studied of indoctrination. 
The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. Right. That is my saving grace. The Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. It's so it was Sovereign that was controlling the Solarians. Why are the Geth following Sovereign? They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god, the pinnacle of their own evolution. Oh. But the reaction of their deity is most telling. It is insulted. Sovereign does not desire the beautiful devotions the Geth hurl at it. They are just tools, and no amount of belief on their part. Do they know them. that's how it feels? But as tools, they are useful. They will survive the coming invasion. If organic life is to survive, we must also prove wow. they're useful. We must work with the Reapers. So do the Geth know that? Do they know that... Oh my goodness. Uh, the Conduit. Tell me why Sovereign needs the Conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop them. The Conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Sovereign needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. <laughs> oh, buddy, you sound pretty indoctrinated to me. <laughs> I don't know. Sovereign's yeah. manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve. Promise? The inevitable. <laughs> yeah. This <gasps> is my only hope. Join me. Oh my gosh. I can say that? <gasps> Join me. Together we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We yeah. can beat them. I no longer believe that, Shepard. Visions cannot be denied. The Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. I think you're wrong. How can you do this? You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers, between organics and machines. And in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. Wow. But you would undo my work. You would do our entire civilization to complete annihilation. And for no. that, you must die. No, sir. Not today, sir. Not today. Uh...
I can't believe that Ash didn't make it. How could we just leave her down there? Just down. Yikes. Okay. She was a good soldier. Williams knew the risks going in. She gave her life to save the rest of us. But why me? Why not her? Well, <laughs> this is my decision, don't question. Never leave you. Well, that's true. I'd never leave you. I'd never leave Rex. I'd never leave Garrus. I'm sorry, Caden. I'd never leave you behind. I couldn't. You know that. I know. And I am grateful. But Ash died because of me. Because of us. I don't want him to blame himself. Help him. It wasn't your fault. It wasn't mm -hmm. my fault. The exactly. only one to blame here is Saren. Yes, ma'am. I'm... We'll get it done. Commander, excuse me for interrupting, <laughs> but I have an idea. I think the beacon you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found You're on Ethan Prime. It may have filled in the missing pieces of your vision. I might be able to help you put all those Wait. pieces together. Excuse me for interrupting. This very, this very intimate and personal conversation. Wow, <laughs> Liara, read the fucking room. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, that was really funny. <laughs> Excuse me, Commander. I'm sorry for interrupting. God, that's so embarrassing. They're all just like. Is that what's happening? I mean, clearly she could hear the conversation if she's like, I'm sorry for interrupting. <laughs> that is so embarrassing. And we're worried about, like, <laughs> what is it? The regulations of um, dating in the ship or whatever. <laughs> I feel like he talked about that before. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. Well... That's something. Uh, do it. <laughs> you want to join our minds again, don't you? Okay, Fun. go ahead. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. <laughs> Did the vision make any sense to you? It's a distress call. A message sent out across the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers, but the warning came too late. Anything else? What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognized from my research. Ilos! Okay. The conduit okay. is on Ilos! That is why Saren needed to find the Mew Relay. It is the only way to get to Ilos. Uh, Alright. You never mentioned this. How come you never told us about Ilos before? The Mew Relay links to dozens of systems and hundreds of worlds. How was I to know Ilos was the All one right, we wanted? Without the cipher, the images in your visions were never clear. Only now do I recognize them as landmarks from right, Ilos. Go. We need to get mm -hmm. to Ilos. Forget it. The Mew relays inside the Terminus systems. Alliance ships are not welcome there. Neither are Spectres. All right. Well, have a little faith, Dolly. We'll be careful. Be careful. The conduit's on Ilos. That's where Saren's heading. I'll be waiting for him when he gets there. Saren will have his entire fleet orbiting Ilos. Why are I will never like make that? it down oh. to the surface without <laughs> reinforcements. You must alert the Council. We need a fleet to. Oh. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down Very for a glad. moment. We're done here. Dismissed. Commander, there's a comm buoy nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn them about Sovereign. Of course, the game zooms in on Rex. <laughs> of course. 
I feel so bad about this. There has to be. That's all right. Well, let's talk to the council. Let's see how. Let's see what they're gonna do to piss me off. Set the link up, Joker. <laughs> they need to know. Like, maybe don't be an Matching asshole. Approval. It's really not the day. I hope you don't plan to cut us off like last time, Commander. What you discovered on Vermeer is too important. <laughs> well, I might. Sounds <laughs> formidable enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. I hope you don't cut us off. Well, then don't be assholes, okay? Uh, we've got bigger problems, also. The Krogan would have served Sovereign, a Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine. A true artificial intelligence. This news is quite alarming. If it turns out to be accurate. If it turns out to be accurate? You don't believe me? Sovereign's real. The Reapers are real. Saren even admitted I hate it. Them. He's playing you, Shepard. Saren still has contacts on the city. Yeah, you. You're, You're the contact, your obviously. Reports, the ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. Oh my god. It's highly possible Saren is using false information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. Disconnect. Fuck off. Aw, uh, looks like we lost the signal, Joker. Understood, Commander. <laughs> <laughs> I like how it sounds like Joker's laughing as he says that. I hate the council. I hate the council. Wow. You assholes. Premier was a lot different than I thought it would be. I think that this is a good place to stop. And next time we come back, we'll see our companions have any reaction to what happened but wow I didn't love Ashley as a character but I do think it's sad that we don't get to see what could have happened what her arc would have been what her story would have been like I I think that's incredibly sad and I'm really inter interested to see what that might do to Shep and Caden's relationship and I'm also interested to see like what these decisions do to Shep going forward this was heavy 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 Sovereign is a reaper. What are we gonna do with that? We've seen we've seen what it did to those Solarians. And this I couldn't couldn't save Captain Karai. Kira he keeps but you guys I think that is I wonder if there's like a way to save him. I don't know. Maybe maybe <laughs> Maybe in another playthrough, but that that feels like we didn't hold the line. Yeah, uh, that sucks. <laughs> that was an emotional episode. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, Vermeer broke me a little bit. Uh, it broke me. Uh, if you know anything about me, if you know me like in real life, you know the one thing I'm gonna do, uh, if I'm gonna do anything, it, it's cry. <laughs> um, I cry when I'm happy, I cry when I'm sad, when I'm mad, when I find things beautiful, and gosh, this episode just pushed me to tears in so many different places. Um, and I am a little embarrassed to be crying on the internet, uh, but it's just something that I've had to accept about myself. I also really believe in, um, really believe in Jimmy V's outlook on life, on what a full day is. You know, a full day is a day where you do three things and you think and you laugh and you're moved to, to emotion, moved to tears. That is a full day. And 
I think the beauty of this game is that you can do all three of those things in one sitting, in one episode. And it's really just a testament to how well done this series is. It's a beautiful story with beautiful characters. And there's a lot of times where I won't remember. I'll read a book and I won't remember the lore of it all, but I'll remember how it made me feel. Or I'll play a video game and I won't necessarily remember the quest line, but I know that I walked away feeling something and being really invested in those characters. And I know that that is what Mass Effect has done for me personally. Um, there are lines from books and, and, and other games and movies that I'll always remember. You know, hope is a coin I carry. I did my best. I did my best. And I think we held the line. Ooh, and we will hold the line. Oh, my God. That hate that I couldn't, that I, I didn't know how to save them. You know, that is uh, going to be really hard. That one is going to be a hard one to kind of deal with moving forward. I'm sure there's some kind of consequences for really scuffing that. There were um, really hard choices in this episode, too. I think that I think it's awful and I think it's so sad that Ashley doesn't forget like that Ashley doesn't get her redemption arc we'll never see at least in this playthrough we'll never see what was in store for her and her character and if she could move past some of the beliefs that she has and I think that's sad you know obviously these uh writers and developers they went to game of thrones writing school because they don't seem to be afraid to kill off main characters i mean i guess it's us making the choices but putting the choices in front of us so yeah and the game's getting i mean it was serious always right but this feels like that turning point where the train has left the station and there is no <laughs> turning back the cat is out of the bag and we are moving towards something that, you know, it's not fun in games anymore. And that makes me really nervous. I'm really nervous to see what the consequences of my choices have been. And, you know, part of me, when I listened to what Saren had to say in the, that confrontation, part of me felt bad for him. You know, uh, especially when he, when I had the option to say he's a puppet, because I've said many times that I feel like Sin is just a puppet. She is just dancing to everyone's tune. So, while not necessarily the same, she knows a little bit, or maybe she understands just a little bit what he is going through. But then, you know, I have this other knowledge in the back of my head because I am reading Revelations, and you know, it's like he's always kind of been a bastard, and so. I said in my bro Shep playthrough, it's just, it's, it's a circle. It is a circle of shitty choices and no one is breaking the circle. And I don't even know if Sin can break the circle. You know, she, she, I guess is a little, she's a paragon, right? We're on the paragon path, but she definitely, this episode made some not paragon choices and she's to a breaking point i think you know it's like she's taken and taken and taken and now what now what now it, can she always continue on this path can she always be better can she keep pushing like she had her friend someone she respects and cares for pull a gun on her because she had to tell him that the cure for the entire race his entire race is like almost there like he can almost get it and she had to tell him no I think people can only take, ugh, I don't know. See, I get way too into these uh, games and I think way too far into it. I don't know if it's like just because I play D&D &D and you know, every week we're, we're doing this anyway <laughs> as we DM and, and create stories and weave stories together. But I think about that stuff. How's this gonna affect him going forward? What is she gonna be like? Does it harden her? Will she always be the hero? I mean, I hope so, but I think there's starting to be some cracks there, you know? Um, and I guess we'll just have to see. We will just have to see. Very nervous, very excited, 
don't know how this is gonna end and how it's all gonna turn out, but damn, I am enjoying the ride. This is a wonderful game. It, it is a really good game. And I'm so thankful that I kinda like stumbled onto it. <laughs> so until next time.